So I'll go back through this, guys, real quick, and then we'll get to another one. So yeah, exactly, guys. If we have a 45, 45 degree triangle, what we have looked at is 45 degree triangles are very special because they are part of a square. So we know that the two legs have to be equal to each other, right? Remember, we started, we created this 45, 45 degree triangle from a square. And we know that the legs are going to be exactly the same. So if this is 11, Jay, can you put your knees under your desk, please? Is this, if this is 11, then this has to be 11, right? Because the 45, 45 is part of that square that we've already talked about. Now, the last thing is, if we look at our relationship, what we did is what we found out that the relationship between the legs and the hypotenuse all right, was you just take your leg and multiply it by the square root of 2. So all I need to do, Caleb, is just take my leg and multiply it by the square root of 2. And that's it. That's my final answer. And it might ask you to approximate one. Um, sometimes, so sometimes you have to maybe approximate it depending on the answer or the question. So if we just want to approximate this one, we could do 11 times, whoa, where's your square root in here? Oh, you got it. Oh, I don't know how to calculate that. Jeez. All right. Well, again, this answer would just be left um, in that form for us to go through, okay? And again, it's very interesting. Um, uh, 